hi guys! We're gonna discuss about unit circle. So determining whether the point lies on, outside, or inside. Say to determine whether the point lies on, inside, or outside the unit circle, we will use the equation x squared plus y squared is equal to 1. So the first condition is, if x squared plus y squared is equal to 1, then the point lies on the unit circle. So the second condition is, if x squared plus y squared is greater than 1, then the point lies outside the unit circle. Now the last condition is, if x squared plus y squared is less than 1, then the point lies inside the unit circle. So guys, we're now here on our first example. So square root of 3 over 2 squared plus negative 1 half, don't forget the squared, is equal to 1. Square root of 3 over 2 squared will give you 3 over 4 plus negative 1 half squared will give you 1 over 4 is equal to 1. So as you can see, you have the same denominator. So you will just add the numerator which is 3 plus 1 that will give you 4. And 4 over 4 is equal to 1, so then that means 1 is equal to 1, and then the point lies on the unit circle. That's it. So now we have our example number 2. So negative 1 fourth squared plus 3 over 4 squared is equal to 1. Negative 1 fourth squared will result to 1 over 16, and 3 fourth squared will result to 9 over 16. As you can see, you have the same denominator. You just add the numerator, so that will result to 10 over 16. And then 10 over 16 in the calculator will give you 0 0.63 in decimal. And 0 0.63 is less than 1, so the point lies inside the unit circle. So guys, we're now in the last example. So square root of 5 over 2 squared plus square root of 6 over 2 squared is equal to 1. Square root of 5 over 2 squared will result to 5 over 4. And then square root of 6 over 2 squared will give you 6 over 4. So as you can see again, you have the same denominator. You'll just simply add the numerator so that will give you 11 over 4. And if you will see that in the calculator, 11 over 4 is equal to 2.75 in decimal so 2.75 is greater than 1 so simply that is then the point lies outside the unit circle thank you guys for watching my video i hope you like it feel free to comment down below for suggestions for my next video God bless!